Hi everyone, we are Team Sentinels from SNDK Catholic. I'm Wilson. Hi, I'm Rima. Hi, I'm Anson. Here is our problem statement. Monthly electricity bills are expensive for school. School principals are having a hard time sustaining their budget to improve the school facility, which allows the student to study in a more comfortable environment. And this applies to our school principal, Dr. Margaret, as well. You may ask, what about the existing solution that many schools are currently using? For instance, solar panels are one of the more popular renewable energy generating technologies in Malaysia. It comes with a myriad of benefits, mainly allowing us to generate electricity through the light energy from the sun. However, solar systems can only produce energy with ample amount of sunlight. The location and the total number of hours your system can be exposed to the sunlight will determine how much energy can the system produce. In Malaysia, the amount of peak sunlight hours vary from 4 to 6 hours. Besides that, solar panels also tend to generate less power in Malaysia because our sky has many clouds and the solar panels efficiency drops considerably if, the, if it doesn't get direct to sunlight. In addition, Malaysia faces two monsoon, monsoon wind season, the southwest, the southwest monsoon from late May to September and the northwest monsoon from October to March. The annual rainfall recorded varies from 2000 mm to 2500 mm, thus disrupting the use of solar panels in our beloved tropical country. And that's why we made it our goal to create a solution that will be beneficial to all. So we are proud to present to you Evolution. Why Evolution, you may ask? Well, it came from the word economics and revolution. It's a technology that generates electricity by collecting the impact of the rain. The rain, when the rain accelerates through the atmosphere, it collects velocity and more force. Once it impacts the roof, the velocity and force collected are released. With that, energy will be generated through our product. Not to mention, air pollution also works under conditions such as wind because of the material, the sensitivity of the materials that we chose. Furthermore, air pollution also works under the condition of hail and snow. It consists of piezoelectric sensors, which is the part that plays the most important role in our project. They generate voltage when force is applied. The reason we chose these sensors is because they are able to generate electricity easily. On the other hand, evolution also consists of solar panels, which are what most schools are currently using. They tend to generate electricity through sunlight and work together with the piezoelectric sensors to generate more electricity in order to reduce the electricity bills and to create a friendly environment for all. Besides that, a water tank which helps collect the rainwater from the roof is also included as a part of our project. Last but not least, we also have an LED strip that shows that um, the electricity generated can actually be used. So now, we will be demonstrating how it works. I will be using a special apparatus, my hand, in order to apply stress and stimulate rain. As you can see here, Voltage was able to be generated easily just from that small amount of stress applied to the piezoelectric sensor. Now, what about wind? I'll just give this device a quick blow. As you can see, it's harvesting energy. Now, with the amount of electricity generated, we will be able to use them to turn on daily electrical appliances such as light. With the light being on, the voltages stored will decrease. So, what you just saw was a feasible device that has the potential to be implemented into not just schools, but houses as well in the future. In a nutshell, evolution helps save electricity bills as well as provide a friendly environment to the earth. We strongly believe that the presence of evolution will make a great impact on the society, especially if everyone works together to make it possible. As the saying goes, united we stand, divided we fall. Thank you for listening.